Yo, YouTube, it's your boy Premier back today with another banger. And in today's video, we're going to be going over the best Kevin Durant build in NBA 2K24. Huge shout out to my boy Miyagi's for helping me lab this build. And let's get straight into it. Oh, and while we're getting into it, like the video if you haven't already. Comment down below when you see the build, what you think of it. And subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn them post notices on. Now, um, 6 8. I also debated on this 7 6 wingspan. You can't physically deny the fact that Kevin Durant has one of the longest wingspans known to man. We will talk about what we had to sacrifice to get that, though. It is what it is. I also wanted to come here and look at Speed Booster. Speed Booster is a very important badge for me on a 6'8". I do also know that Kevin Durant IRL might be 7 foot, but it's like you just can't get what you want on a 7 footer and it still play like Kevin Durant. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Um... Just not a fan of like the lower speed with ball builds. I um, I, I like this Kevin Durant build. I, I think this is a much better version. The silver speed booster is going to be huge here that we get the 82 speed. You have to make sure you have an 81 ball handle though, or excuse me. But yeah, you only need a 75 speed with ball here too for a silver speed booster. Keep that in mind. And there's no bonus of going 77. 2K Labs and uh, two, if I'm not mistaken, one of them did a test on speed with ball. And a speed with ball is not speed. Boot. Okay, we're good. We're good. We got the we got the silver here. My fault. I'm just over here studying as we make the build. The silver speed booster. Like I can't say it stress it enough. It's gonna be so important with how this build moves. If you want to play like Kevin Durant, you're gonna need it. 70 pass act though. A lot of the pro -am community. I'm starting to hear the 70 pass act is kind of the threshold for like the um, the locks and some of the other builds. Now, if you want. A higher three ball on your Kevin Durant build, which I totally think it should have. It, it's just tough, bro. Like, here, let me break this down for you. Do we give up Kevin Durant's wingspan? Kevin Durant has a wingspan in real life, if I'm not mistaken. It's crazy long. It's like 7'4 or something. Uh, it, probably way longer. It, bro has insane arms. Here's what we're going to do to get some of the badges. If you come up here to 85, the only benefit is getting Silver Whistle. I'm not really... I don't think we need to be trying to worry about increasing the chances of drawing fouls. I, I just don't think that's what you need to be worried about when making a Kevin Durant build. Um, if you want the extra midi for the 85 midi, that's fine. But we're really looking for the silver dead eye. We're looking for the silver blinders. We're looking for these gold and silver shooting badges at minimum. And honestly, I wish we could afford to get a higher three ball. It's just not like other 2Ks where you can afford a high three ball and have a high wingspan. It's not a thing this year. They balance the builder. I gotta tip my cap to 2K. You gotta tip my cap to, to Wolf in particular, the dev team over there. I mean, they did fantastic this year. This is one of the most balanced builders we've had in a long time. Now, 60 vert just to start. We're gonna talk about why we're gonna end up coming up on that. Make sure you're checking your attributes here too. When you're doing your builds, if you're not like paying attention and say you upgrade one thing, it's gonna upgrade like two, three other things. So please keep that in mind when you're upgrading your builds. <clears throat> Make sure you don't have any extra attributes in any slots. It's very important. Now, for an underrated part of Kevin Durant's game that I think is fantastic on this build. By the way, you can shoot with the 78 three ball, bro. Yes, you need to be tapped in. Yes, you need to be like that. Um, I mean, I have a jump shot. I feel comfortable at 78. If you don't know about JT Thor, bro, just throw on JT Thor. JT Thor is a soup for these low three ball builds. You will be fine. It's a fast jump shot. Like a, a Kevin Durant type, just, ah, you know what I mean? You're, you're going to pull it on him. You're good. And if you want contact dunks to go with this build too, come up to an 89. You could honestly come up to like a 93 too if you're willing to give up on an underrated part of Kevin Durant's game, which is his defense. We're going to talk about his defense here in a second, but for this tall, kind of tall, ISO, demigod, Kevin Durant type build, you got to have standing dunk this year. I'm, I'm, I, honestly, the, the comp community would get mad if people start promoting this standing dunk. I'm, I'm trying to put you all in the suit. I'm trying to put you on the sauce, bro. Standing dunk is the meta this year. It's very important. A lot of the comp community is not even doing any type of driving dunk. They're doing like 60, 65, really low. I mean, I've even seen 50 and 55 driving dunks just for the basic two-handers off one. That's more suit, you know, for the loyals listening all the way through. Comment suit down below if you just heard that. I I'm just curious. Um, we giving out the suit, man. We giving out the sauce. Let's um, let's look here though. You're gonna need that 70 vert for the bronze posterizer. Um, you're gonna need a 68 black at minimum for chase down bronze. 
if you want to go back and lower the arms so you get a higher three ball this is an area we could talk about you don't need this high of defense on this build this is just me looking at kevin Durant and the fact he is a demigod in real life and he can do everything he plays great on the perimeter he's a great well i'm not gonna say great but he's a very slept on around the rim defender slept on rebounder i mean he holds down the power forward position when they run small ball out there in phoenix um held it down fine in golden state as well uh, it's just Kevin Durant can do so much on the court. He can work out of the post. He can dunk on you. I mean, he's going to blow by you if he wants. He, he's going to get his teammates open. It's a matter of what, how Kevin Durant wants to score. It, it's just completely up to him. But looking here at the defensive rebounding, we're going to bring it up to an 83. I want silver defensive. My goal was to get a very balanced build because Kevin Durant can do pretty much everything in real life. And... I mean, if, if you're really going to be working out of the post, make sure you at least do a 58 offensive rebound so you can get that um, bronze post playmaker. I think that's something kind of slept on. Also, you can get silver anchor on this build too if you're willing to give up the shooting. This is the version I decided to go with. If y'all want the more offensive version, I lab. I stopped throwing in multiple versions, bro. The watch time, y'all weren't watching them all the way through. I'm, I'm not going to be doing like double versions of the build anymore. Um, if y'all want those, comment down below double build where I'll just show both builds at the same time in kind of one video. But I did lab an offensive version with a higher three ball. Um, get this video to 100 likes if y'all want that, man. Uh, looking here at the offensive rebound though this is something that I'm just like eh. I just want fearless finisher bro like am I tripping here I, I want fearless finisher I honestly wish we could get physical handles and if I was gonna come off of anything we could come off of this defense a little to get physical handles um, that's something you could do as well you could maybe come down on the um, rebounding if you're gonna be playing with like a big man you could come down on the block if you're going to be like playing threes you know you have a lock in center with you just different stuff to think about you can kind of come down on the um perimeter d block defensive rebounding if you wanted more strength or if you want more shooting um this is probably the version of the build i'm going to end up rocking out with come down here on the stamina though i don't think that 98 or whatever we had it on is needed it's not affecting anything i really don't think it's that big of a deal to come down on the stand and honestly hold on hold on i mean like I don't know. When I think of Kevin Durant, we, we got to get this free throw up a little too. He's like, he shoots like 90%. We need a little... We, honestly, I wish we could have got free points at least on bronze. That would have been nice for my pro-am and rec sweats. Uh, but this is the build we're rocking with, man. Tell me what you think of it down below. Comment down below. Let's get a vibe check here on the build name. Let's see. Let's see. Golden State. Imagine it's like KD. Golden State. Oh, Andrew Wiggins. Okay. Scotty Barnes. Okay. Gerald Wallace. Okay. Three-level threat. That's Kevin Durant, man. That's Kevin Durant. Put a smile on my face. Comment down below what you think of the build. Like the video if you haven't already. Oh, and I also will show a flash here for the lawyers who stayed all the way through. This is kind of what I'd walk out into the park with. Um, yeah, man. It's your boy Premier, and I'm out. Peace.